Woods World, Woods World. Hi everyone, hope you're all staying safe and enjoying lockdown. I can't remember what week is it, is it week eight? I'm sure that it's week eight. I hope that you're enjoying the sunshine, it's beautiful out there, but drinking plenty of water, keeping yourself hydrated. Make sure you've got some suntan lotion on, because I know I'm very fair skinned and I can then burn very easily so yes i've been out in the garden planting some flowers i painted a bench um but i've had to be really careful because with my fair skin and my hair color sometimes you you can get really really hot really quickly so i've had to use a lot of suntan lotion drink plenty of water so i can keep myself hydrated and healthy because the last thing i want to do is say that they open school and we get ready to go back to school and i'm sick because i haven't drunk enough or so I've got headaches or migraines or whatever so keep yourself safe do enjoy the sunshine um have an ice cream in the garden or um, go out for a nice walk just be safe bring water with you i really like putting a bottle of water in the freezer and it's so nice and cold when you get it out it's like an ice lolly <laughs> So just keep yourself hydrated and really enjoy the sunshine. So, I hope your week has been productive um, and you've enjoyed your week. Let's see. So, last week's quiz we had number two theme tune of the TV programme. Of course, it was Casualty. Then we have, oh, what did we have? Oh yes, um, oh yes, guess the characters, wasn't it? So name the character from a film, it was Hulk, and four, it was when they have their massive fight. Uh, oh, um, number four was Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, I want to see that, um, as it was a birthday present. And it was absolutely out of this world. Absolutely amazing. And the song title and musical was obviously Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Um, another all-time favourite. So maybe you got some of those. Maybe you, you didn't. But this week I'm going to go with skills of drama. Try and um, mix things up a little bit. Here it goes. Question number one. What do you call the technique in which there are two scenes on stage? Is it A, non-verbal communication, B, still image, C, cross-cutting, or D, mine? I'm going to say that question again. Question one. What do you call the technique in which there are two scenes on stage a non-verbal communication b still image c cross-cutting or d mine okay question number two blank work is essential for a good performance is it a team B, good, C, hard, or D, independent? Blank work is essential for a good performance. Is it A, team, B, good, or is it C, hard, or D, independent? Question number three. Which technique requires no talking? Is it A, verbal, B, still image, C, melodrama, or D, non-verbal? Which technique requires no talking. Is it A, verbal, B, still image, 
C, melodrama, or D, nonverbal. Question number four. Over the top is used in A, acting, B, silent movie, C, melodrama, or D, still image. Over the top is used in A, acting, B, silent movie, C, melodrama, or D, still image? Hmm. Question number five. Shakespeare plays either end in comedy or A, tragedy, B, misery, C, happiness, or D, disaster? Shakespeare's plays either end in comedy or A. Tragedy B. Misery C. Happiness or D. Disaster hmm. Question number six Body language, levels, facial expressions and... A. Lights B. Performance C. Volume D. Space Body language, levels, facial expressions and A. Lights B. Performance C. Volume D. Space Hmm, question seven. A hard one, this one. An interesting plot is key for a level A, six, B, seven, C, five, or D, four. An interesting plot is key for a level A, six, B, Seven, C, five, or D, four. This is mainly for year 10 and 11, but if year seven to nine could get this, that'd be interesting. Question number eight. Monologue is performed by how many people? A, three. B, 4, C, 1, D, 2. A monologue is performed, monologue is performed by how many people? Is it A, 3, B, 4, C, 1, or D, 2? Question number 9. A show with acting, singing and dancing is what type of performance? Is it A, comedy, B, a play, C, a sketch show, or D, musical theatre? A show with acting, singing and dancing is what type of performance? Is it A, comedy, B, a play, C, a sketch show, or D, musical theatre. And last but not least, question number 10. A triple threat can do what? A, act, sing, be comedic. B, dance, sing, act. C, sing, be, a, be comedic, dance, or D, be comedic, act, dance. A triple threat can do what? A, act, sing, be comedic. B, 
dance, sing and act. C. Sing, be a comedic and dance. Or D. Comedic, act and dance. Well, there are your 10 questions with multiple choice answers. Good luck. I will reveal the answers next week. Well, that's me for another week, and I hope you have a lovely day and enjoy yourself. I'm off for an ice cream. I've been told the ice cream van's just come round, so I'm off for an ice cream. Enjoy your week off, because it's half term next week. So have a relax. Stop working, some of you, because I know some of you are working extremely hard. And enjoy your week off. I will see you later. Bye! Woods World, Woods World.